Hello everybody, welcome back to Evolve, we're going to be playing as Goalie. We are on Wraith Trap for this one. Recently off the back of a Voodoo game, we recently did White Tiger as well, didn't we? Hmm. Do Savage. I think this has been fairly recent as well. I don't keep track of the skins properly, but, you know, I try to show, a, a, a share, you know, a decent share of them here and there. We'll do the uh, regular perks. Uh, Val, Carla, Abe, and Red Abe for this. We will see. It is on Favours Hunters, so it's the hardest difficulty that this game allows. Time will tell. Go to the left this time. Normally go straight forward on this map. Right up the ass. Good, good, good. So just at the beginning here, we're just getting some bars into the meter, just in case we have a bad first fight. It's always good to have a couple of bars closer to the uh, stage up. Should it be needed? The area have just been tracked. What do us? Didn't want to see that. We've still got the uh, respawn time, haven't we? Need to remember Carla's on this team as well because she can bypass her armor. Right, fuck this. We're going for Val. Where'd she just go? There. Fucking hell, that was a stupid place to do that. Okay, based on the damage and how tanky they are, there's some meta perks going on here. Yep, definitely. So we're getting out. This is why you don't add perks into the game that didn't need them. I'm not going to go on about it. It's fine. I will just say the piece, just so you've got context here. So what you've just witnessed is down to the perk system of this game. Um, it is on the hardest difficulty, but it's, you know, this doesn't happen every game. And I'm, I've got reason to believe that uh, bots do use randomised perks. So, in this instance, they've basically high-rolled all the busted shit, which is what you see in here. Uh, the legacy version of this game had nine perks in it to balance over its lifetime. These perks were split amongst just the stuff that you need. Smell range, damage, defence, climb speed just things like that, they were all single effect, basically, you know, um, and there was nine of them, and that's all you'd need to balance for the game's lifetime, you just switch the numbers if things were getting a bit too egregious, you know. This version of the game has easily 50 plus different perks, and they all guarantee different fucking effects, each one of them. Some of them have climb speed with defense, some of them have defense with feed speed, some of them have movement speed, some of them have traversal regen, some of them have defense with climb speed and all sorts of things, you know, you get the idea. All the different combinations, it is needlessly convoluted shite that didn't need to exist in this game. And it is a reason why it became so hard to balance. But that goes for any game, you know? But that's what you witnessed in that first fight. That's the overpowered side of things. So what we are going to do here is, by virtue of the team that I'm against, we're going to push very close to stage 3 here. By doing a little bit more feeding than normal. We get armor region. Just stop them from getting uh, jetpacks as well, so. Well, 
right, we're going to try this again. There we are. Target now is going to be Carla, because we need to uh, make sure we can remove her quickly. No, we need to conserve HP, because we are against Carla. Armor doesn't mean anything. Check to see if Poison X has spawned. It hasn't. I think what we're going to do is just go straight to stage 3 and just ignore all gameplay because the perks exist in this game, unfortunately. Just grab the uh, stage 3 uh, power spike. Because we have to here because Carla exists. So I can't let my HP go too low, otherwise we just die. And given how much damage they're doing to me, I've not got much of a window. So Like, outside of perks, there is no reason for this team to be doing as much damage as it is doing. So that's why I've come to the conclusion that it is the perks. Renegade Abe without perks is actually dog shit. So... For him to be doing this much damage, it's without Cabot as well. It's pretty obvious. I'm just assuming this bot has rolled all three attack damage perks, maybe. I don't know what the fuck I'm doing there, I'm trying to. They're over there for some reason. That's weird. Squash up from Carla. I'm gonna play it safe though. I'm gonna go for uh, Val. We get a push down there. Stay out of line of sight of Carla as much as possible, I do. We need to go and get damage buff, I think. Just spawned by now, I hope. Has not spawned yet. Poison hits has though. We'll go and take poison. Well, it's not here. Spawn over there in front of that cave when it's ready. There's like a time limit on it, hidden time limit. Might be a couple of minutes out yet because it's been quite a short game. It's not good. Miss up. We're actually going for Carla. I need to do what I said I was going to do. Twelve vials not present. So we know Abe's got regeneration because Val's not here, but he was healing there. It's the regen perk. I need to get the fuck out uh, in as quickly as possible here. We 
do get that. It's going to be Abe dead as well. Just before uh, I'll get back. Go back immediately for armor. Just try and isolate him, but. I think he's used his shield, is it? She's just going to keep the armor rolling, though. Everybody coming back in it. Yeah. I need him to drop the dome idea just before a down valve. I don't know where she went, but for fuck's sake, that's fine. It's not fine actually. Move. Thing is, I don't really want ability cooldowns until poisons run out. Honestly, I punish the fuck out of that though. Kyle is still alive. I want full armor. Just fucking grab it. It's fine. Keep him interested so he stays over here. Coming back on that, really. Actually, over there. I genuinely don't know where Carla is at the moment. Can't actually spend any armor because I don't know where Carla is. Like in the office of lesser defense. Yep. He's around there somewhere. What steps? That's a teleporter, maybe. There she is. Be a redone, but she's gonna die. That's actually the worst possible outcome.
Give me, give me. Fucking feet and nail to the ground, man. This is with traversal region. Have a green ape first. Is it finally over? Fucking hell. There you go. Definitely some perk shit going on there, I have to say. There is no feasible reason outside of perks that Abe, or Renegade Abe, I should say, should be putting out that much damage uh, in the first, um, well, the first couple of engages. Especially when we was at stage two and we've lost nearly all the HP from one engage. Ridiculous. There you go. As I say, there shouldn't be this many perks in the game. I've said it before, I'll say it again. But there you go. Regardless, we managed to pull it back. Hope you've enjoyed. And I will hopefully see you for the next one. Bye.